Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with my empties video. This is about two to three months, I believe, um, of empties. Uh, maybe, I think it's about two and a half months of empties here. So, June and July or somewhere like that. Anyway, um, first off, I am going to start off with like a little bit of like my household products, like um, just personal care. So I do have two Bath and Body Works hand soaps here. We have watermelon lemonade. This is the all right scent. And Wag More Bark Less Orange Vanilla Swirl. I had that in my kitchen. Really liked it. Just smelled like a, a creamsicle. Next up, I have two Bath and Body Works um, shower gels. So we have Santa's Blueberry Shortbread. I'm happy I only bought one of these. There's like a teeny tiny bit left I could have squeezed out, but I got really sick of this scent. Um, it's not something I would get again. It's not awful, but no. And this one is Sugared Cranberry Cider. I actually really love this fragrance. It smelled really good. Uh, yeah, one of my favorites. All right. I do have two um, candles here. They are both from Goose Creek. We have Pumpkin Cupcake. Uh, it was all right. Not very... Not like super strong. Um, I probably could have kept going a little bit longer, but I just got bored with it. Yeah, nothing too, like, amazing. And then next up we have Blue Raz Icy. This one was pretty good. The, th the throw was not the greatest. And same with the pumpkin cupcake. Um, I did melt these or burn these in smaller rooms. Um... Yeah, I just wasn't really a huge fan, so let's just put those up there, get them out of the way. All right, I have a poopery here. I finished up pink citron. This is strawberry citron and rock candy. This smells so, so good, and the packaging is so cute. Uh, I love this. It smells like strawberry candy. It's amazing. If you like poopery, I would definitely recommend getting this. I picked it up on their website. I have um, these Equate brand. This is the Walmart brand of elderberry gummies. So these are 50 milligrams elderberry per serving. It helps with your immune system. These are vegan. There's no gelatin or any nastiness in here. So I would recommend anyone getting these if you want to boost your immune system. And they taste great. You only take one a day. They're amazing. All right, next up I have three jars of probiotics here. I take one probiotic every day. Um, I have two of the Renew Life. Ultimate Flora Probiotic Women's Vaginal. So this is obviously, and you take it orally. <laughs> um, and it's just a really good probiotic. You want at least 50 billion live cultures. It helps with your digestive system, your vaginal system, like all that kind of stuff. And to, I mean, I hate to be TMI, but if you don't take a probiotic, you definitely should. It it helps a lot. So these are a brand that I really recommend. And then another probiotic I recommend is the Garden of Life um, Women's Daily Care Probiotics. Now these are only 40 billion, but it also has 16 probiotic strains. You want at least 50 billion, but 40 billion is all right, but you want at least 12 strains. So, you know, you, it's whatever. Uh, 10 billion, it's not, as long as I'm getting something and it's, you know, over 30, good. Um, 
So this is immune health, digestive balance, and vaginal health. I really, really like these probiotics too. I definitely tell a difference between not taking them and taking them. All right, we have a little Tatcha, um, the water cream sample that I got in my Ipsy bag. I really enjoyed this. This was really nice. It had a really good scent to it. Uh, just made my skin feel super moisturized. And I would buy this again, but it's so expensive. So, no. One moisturizing cream I go to over and over and over again. What I continue to buy is by Belief. This is the True Cream Aqua Bomb. I've talked about this plenty of times. I got this first off in an Ipsy bag, a little sample, and I just fell in love with it. My skin really enjoys it. It's very good for like any kind of skin type. Um, I have combination to oily skin. Um, and this is amazing. So I'm going through one right now. I finished up this one. The smell is just great. The texture, the feel, the way it makes my skin feel is so, so good. So if you're looking for a really good moisturizer, I highly recommend this one. All right, I have a toothpaste. <laughs> this is by the brand Hello. I love this brand. I usually... Um, this is what I really go to every time I get a toothpaste. So this is the anti-plaque and whitening fluoride-free toothpaste in natural peppermint with tea tree and coconut oil. It is just a really, really good toothpaste. So yeah, that's what I get. And next up, I have a hair product here. My boyfriend's mom, she has a salon, so... I get some hair products from her and it's awesome. I'm super appreciative. This is the Keratin Complex Keratin Obsessed Multi-Benefit Treatment Spray. So it just has so many, so many things um, for your hair that it does. It's very, you know, makes it really healthy and everything and, you know, I just like it. All right, next up we have two sugar scrubs by T uh, Tree Hut. I do get these at Target or Walmart, or I'm sure you can get it anywhere else, but I happen to pick them up at those places. And I did wash out the container and everything so I could show you guys. This is the Lemon Blueberry Tart, and oh my gosh, this smells so good. If you like lemon blueberry, you would love this. It has really, really, um, I would say medium, like, exfoliant. It's not super coarse, but it's not so fine. Um, but this makes my skin smell amazing, and it makes it really soft. I use this all over my body in the shower, uh, my feet, everywhere. It's just really, really good. And then the next scent I have is frosted sugar cookie this kind of smells like a like a cinnamon graham cracker cookie-esque it's really good again very nice uh medium exfoliant and it smells amazing so i think i'm gonna do all this in one video so i don't have to you know <sighs> separate into two yeah, just watch it all at once get yourself snacks drinks <laughs> There's a lot of wax coming, so let get into my Target bag here, sorry. Alright, first up we have Sassy Girl Aroma Beach Blanket Bingo. This is Beach Nights type marshmallow and sugar cookies. If you don't know what Beach Nights is, it is a Bath and Body Works type. It smells marshmallowy and beachy. It's just one of my favorite fragrances. So this blended with... Blackberry was so good. I would get that again for sure. Next up from the bathing garden, we have Blackberry Fudge. This one was from 2017. <laughs> yeah, I got a lot of got a lot of wax. It's pretty old, but it still smelled amazing. It still smelled like how when I got it, you know. It was good. I would buy that again for sure. From this is Scarlet Rain. 
shaving cream, cookies and shaving cream. So it's a blend of Barbershop 1920s blended with Vanilla Bean Noel, and it's amazing. So good. I don't know if she's open anymore. I don't know. Probably not. I don't believe she is. Sweet Sage Scents. We have Mermaid Song, Golden Sands, and Apple Harvest. French Toast from Candles by Victoria. This was okay. I wouldn't get that one again. We have a whole bakery bag. Well, not a whole. It's like a half. Um, this is Easter Egg Hunt. I can't remember what the blend was. I know it was my custom blend, but I'm, it just doesn't smell anymore, and these bags kind of suck. Like, I store them really well, and this just ripped open, and yeah, no. I'm okay with getting rid of it. Alright, we have a Yankee Candle wax that I got from Walmart. This is white. Oh no, this I didn't get from Walmart. I did get from SAS. Um, Yankee Candle. This is white strawberry Bellini. This is so strong. Oh, it smells so good. Like a effervescent, bubbly, orange strawberry drink. We have Blue Harbor Cove, which was really good. Very beachy, salty sea air type coconutty scent really really good very strong all right trying to get all the clamshells here next clamshell we have is also from walmart this is lavender and lemonade i love this one i think i bought multiples of this it's a really 50 50 blend of the floral type lavender but with the sweet lemonade it's it's a really good blend it smelled very well um yeah rainbow unicorn this was kind of on the lighter side but it did smell very fruity and it was it was all right i wouldn't get it again though all right, next up we have Festival Vibes. This one, to me, I've said this in my first haul when I um, when I uh, hauled this video, or when I hauled this wax and showed you guys, uh, this smells exactly like Sangria Berry Freeze from Bath & Body Works to my nose. It's what I can remember. I used to have the, the tri-layer candle, and it's just, it's amazing. We have Salted Caramel Cupcake from Goose Creek. This one was super strong, very salted caramely. It's it's amazing. If you like a salted caramel bakery, you would love that. We have Golden Grahams Strawberry Cheesecake. Uh, this was on the lighter side. Usually it's strong for me. I mean, it is from 2017, but I don't know. I'm just, I'm over it. We have Beach Nights Type Vanilla Oak. Very light scent. Twinkies Black Raspberry Vanilla. This was amazing. I really only smelled the Black Raspberry Vanilla, but I love that scent, so I didn't mind. We have Rock Candy, which I don't even remember what it's... I don't, I don't remember. Alright. Banana Vanilla Ice Cream Pie Crust. I wasn't a huge fan of this. I do like banana scents, but this one was just strange to me. Mimi's Tarts, unfortunately, did go out of business, so you can't order from her anymore. Um, Wildberry Scone. It was alright. Scarlet Rain. It was like a little sample. This is Snake Charmer Black Sea. I honestly am not going to talk about it because I don't really remember it. Lexi's birthday cake. It was a little tiny sample, so I just blended it with something. Strawberry cream filled croissant. Oh my gosh, this was so, so good. <laughs> I would get this in a lot. <laughs> and like truckloads. It's so creamy. The strawberry is very authentic, but it also has a like butteriness from the croissant. If you're looking for a good strawberry bakery set, I would get this one. All right, we have another company that is no longer in business. This is She Loves Cake. This was the Tim Burton box. I know I just filmed uh, 
week <laughs> by weekly wax picks i was having a brain fart and some of these scents were in there i just decided to melt through them and yeah this one sucked i barely smelled anything it was very light you guys know that i'm very open and honest with you i'm not gonna feed you any lies <laughs> or you know just to make the company look good that's just not how i am i don't think any should anyone should be like this or like that we have severus snape honey gingerbread candied butter ginger brown butter frosting i have this one going right now and honestly i smell nothing draco malfoy i blended this with something else from this company i want to say it was the corpse bride but this one sucked barely smelled it this one also sucked <laughs> Like, I'm very disappointed in this company, but I mean, she's close, so, mm. yeah, it wasn't good. And then the last one from She Loves Cake was this one. This is the one I blended with Draco Malfoy. This is Spookies and Cream Milkshake mixed with Vanilla Pumpkin Marshmallow, so it was a bunch of vanilla. You would think you would be able to smell it, but there was nothing there. Counting Sheep. This is one of my all-time favorite fragrances from the Bunny Sisters. It's just a very calming, relaxing lavender scent. It's kind of like a lavender, vanilla lavender type scent, but it's just got something else to it that I absolutely love. It definitely calms me, so I like to get this a lot when I order, which I haven't ordered wax in a while, so there's that. All right. Oh, I have another clamshell in here that I missed. I'm trying to pull everything out of this bag. Oh, I had another poopery in here. It was buried all at the bottom of the bag. This was one of their fall fragrances. I don't believe you can get it on their website right now. This is Wild Pear. Pear, cinnamon, and clove. Love that for the fall. Alright. Palm Beach Paradise. This one I would not get again. It's very weird. Uh, it smells very like kerosene to me. A lot of I know it has pineapple in there, but a lot of pineapple scents to me, my nose pick up kind of like a kerosene fragrance, and that's a no go. No go for me. So I'm very like iffy when it comes to pineapple scents. All right, we have Sweden. This is. White cake, apples, vanilla ice cream, pie crust. Didn't smell anything. Avis Country Cupboard, lavender cream cheese flapjacks. I love this scent. I was never into like sweet lavender, but I'm starting to like it. It's past like year I've been getting into it more and this was amazing. I didn't really smell the flapjacks, which I'm not bad about, but the lavender cream cheese was amazing. No sour note nothing. We have Relax, which was definitely a very herbal medicinal lavender. Came in like a little pill shape. It was so cute. But if you don't like herbal or medicinal lavender, you would not like this. I, however, like it. I find it relaxing. We have Pizzelle Orange Danish Cream Cheese. This was okay. Nothing, nothing amazing. We have Pinkberry Tonka Bean in Champure, which is the Nevada type. I love this. This was really good. Very strong. I would order this again if she was open. Uh, Alkazam, I honestly don't remember. We have two left from Mimi's Tart, which is Mountain Dew and Cherry Bomb. I did blend these together, kind of like a cherry Mountain Dew, and it was fantastic. Her cherry is one of my all-time favorites. Again, sadly, she is closed um, as a vendor, so that's upsetting, but I enjoyed her stuff while I have it. We have from Woof Wicks. This was Banana. Candy cherries, whipped cream, pie crust, ice cream, scoop bread. This is a big old loaf. This sucked. I didn't smell anything. Um, just her wax. It's not, not working out for me. 
I used to order a lot from her, and now, melting through it, I'm just like, what? I don't get it. Okay, anyway. <laughs> we have Santeria. We have one left. This is just way, way too strong for me. That's why I'm just gonna get rid of it. Warm sand, sea salt, fresh ocean water, and tropical fruit. It's, it wasn't my favorite either, so I'm not worried about it. And that is all for my empties videos. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this one. I know it was kind of long. I hope you got your snacks and everything. But thank you for sticking with me. And while I kind of go through this time and process of all this stuff. <laughs> if you watch my, my bi-weekly wax picks, you know what's up. Um, but I'm not going to sit here and talk about it again. Anyway, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.